I'll be brief. I want to thank you for coming. This is a beautiful theater. It's Green Coonskin and heavy traffic. Um, the reason I love traffic so much, it proves that Fritz wasn't an accident and that adult human characters could play as well as stupid animals. And that was a very important film for me. And um, the film I love the best next to Coonskin, or as much as Coonskin. So I want to thank you. I haven't seen the film on a big screen in many years. And thanks for coming out.
and them loving what I was doing was them backing me up. Now, of course, some guys walked out of the studio, but the, the, uh, all, everyone did not love me, but the guys are fans and all those great old timers. I mean, you have to understand, I was a young kid coming out of New York, and this was the history of animation sitting in my studio doing this kind of stuff. And I'd walk in the morning and they'd say, tell me what to do, Ralph. I was, you know, I was in a position where I wanted them to tell me. I wanted to ask them what to do. You know? <laughs> and they were asking me. So they made me feel like a director because they believed in what I wanted. Um, so I can't say enough about my, my anime. They all died, of course, by now. Um, I'm the last man standing and I barely got up there. <laughs> I think about them a lot, and I thank you for asking that question. But that was the creep of the Hollywood short business. The next picture you have a lot of Disney animators that came over because they loved what we were doing. And a lot of ex-Disney guys animated on Kuzian. That's, that's a great plus Sir Spence and Virgil Ross. And so what you have is the best of the short, the best of Disney animators supporting me. I wish I had more money to support them. And I wish they were around today to see that the pictures are still playing. You know, that was quite a, sh was a controversy, the yelling and the screaming and, you know, the horror show. Oh my God, I don't believe he did that. That permeated the air. But these pictures are still playing to young kids like you, and they would be very proud. So, uh, thanks for the question. Uh, what were your intentions behind the use of stereotypes? Like what? <laughs> like, um, like, for instance, like, um, I guess the father, he had this, Kind of like the delusion of this, this African American turning to Asian body as baseball. What were your, you know, your intentions behind it? There's a lot of stereotypes. Okay, I'll tell you why. It was cartoony. It's not the art of cartoony. That's taking things too extreme. That, that to be feeling emotionally correct. That's the art form. That makes people understand what I'm doing. The guy that ripped off the Italian's face was black people getting even for how the mafia has treated them in Harlem over the years. In other words, that was taking care of business. Um, that's what that was about. Angie was a fat Italian racist, and that's what that was about. Uh, Ida was a stupid Jewish mother, and that's what that was about. And that's my job as a cartoonist to do it. If you want me to walk around sabotaging everyone, then that's not real either. You know, so um, I'm not angry, but I'm saying that's, that gets your attention, and that gets right to the truth. But sometimes that's how people are. You know, people are who they are, and I didn't make them that way. You know, if you're looking around the world today, you can see what's going on. Hillary Clinton went to Bosnia and ducked every bullet that wasn't shot at them. Um, <laughs> you know, and you got some of your top black leaders, quote unquote leaders, who aren't backing Obama. What kind of madness is that? You got the first black president ready to roll, and Sharpton, and, and all your other black guys just, just aren't there. Where were they? Working for Clinton? So that's how people are. And if I was to get involved in that in animation, it really is these stereotypes. <laughs> that's what I do, you know, the point is everything else is a lie. I need to be closer to the truth than not, you know. So that's who I am. Um, that's who I am. We're gonna take a short break and sign some books outside. Oh last question. Thank you. Last question. Um, I'm sorry, I think I'm not playing as a I'm glad that you've done it. Um, Thank you. I'll leave the years, and then I almost can say I kind of had my best development of the years in front of this stuff. When are we going to see another one? I've had, but I ain't the same guy. You know, we all just talking about. Um, I can get angry if someone asks me a question. I think. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not the same guy. I paint now, I paint for a gallery. And, it's up to someone else to do it. I try to teach now and scream at people to get going. I can't stand this presidential thing and what they're doing to the best man in the block and how the country's just sitting here and how every black in the country should be behind Obama immediately. Um, and they're not, which I am stunned at. And he's really the best candidate out there um, by far. Um, and yet he's looking so I don't know. I'd like to do another one. I don't know if I can come up for it. I don't know if I can. I don't often get that angry again when I'm working. All my animators died. That was a big blow to me. These guys um, that I cared for so much were all dead.